Bye. Oh, good. Thank you. All right. One of our favorite award-winning pastry chefs, Maureen Leonard. Hi. Y'all love Hi. Maureen, right? Yeah. She, just, yeah. she just passed you. She's here with her graduating senior students, and she's sharing a recipe that actually anyone can make for an upcoming graduation party. This is a fun idea. But before we get to the star of the show, we got to talk about your seniors. Introduce yourself and tell us where you're headed next as you graduate. So my name is Yasmeen, and I'm the owner of Mina Christina's Baking Company. So I'm going to wow. keep going with that. Already started. Yes. That's awesome. My name is Logan Samuels, and I am the owner of Logie Sweets and Treats. Um, and I'm going to continue with that as well. That's great. OK, who did A Alex? <laughs> Alex is with Maureen every week. We love he's it's like he works here. <laughs> um, my name is Alex. Yes. Um, I will be at Kent State next uh, Next fall. Yeah. I can't believe it's fast. I know. But right? anyway, um, yes, I will be getting my bachelor's and I plan on working in this beautiful hospitality of experience. And, and he will do very well. He's so complimentary every time he's in here. He boosts our self esteem. <laughs> okay, who do we have here? Hey, uh, my name is Richard Norman, and um, eventually I want to start my own food truck. Good for you. Yeah. Those are super popular. They are. Talk about graduation parties. People are doing that these days as well. And then what's your name? Yeah, I'm Sarah and I want to continue my life down the world of pastries. That's awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Maureen, you have some good students. I know. We'll see. They're going to put me out of business. Yeah. <laughs> I can go work for them. That's a good thing. That's but it does thing. say a lot about Tri-C. Yes, it does. And the, the awesome seniors that you let we graduate do. every we have, year. We have great staff. Yeah. We have a great staff. And we are constantly busy. And we decided since we had so many graduation parties, we just had yeah. a graduation dinner for all of these guys. And it was beautiful. Oh, how fun. So we got to feed them. And I thought, instead of having a donut stand or a at your party. Char or charcuterie right. trays. Or charcuterie trays. <laughs> yes. You know, Lunchables for adults. That's what, uh, yes. that's what my lunchables husband calls adults. them. Correct. Oh my God, no, Marie, I know. My grandma, J, my grandma J associate is going to kill me. But we made <laughs> soft pretzels instead because yes, all you need fun. is flour, water, yeast, butter, and some patience. I know. It, that's, the, that's the key. <laughs> so, okay. And we made all kinds of toppings to go for it. So Richard made this lovely um, beer cheese sauce Ooh, because Richard, we have... what's in the beer sauce? Uh, beer. Yes. The Tri C <laughs> rivalry, um, the, ri the brewing company, yeah. sibling rivalry brew. We have our own 60 year anniversary beer. Really? Yes, it's very cool. Oh my gosh! So this one was your idea, Richard? We'll just we'll leave it yeah. at that. Yeah. Um, it's uh, white American cheese, uh, beer, and jalapenos. Oh my gosh! And some spices. Okay. But in order to taste it first, Chris, yes. you have to learn how to roll a pretzel. So okay. you have to me and Logan got this going for you. So ready? All right. You're gonna roll oh. it like a worm. So she got it going for it you. Roll it like a worm. Roll it like a worm. All right, Sarah. Then Sarah was teaching me how to toss. And turn it I yesterday, but I can't. Like, I'm not that. You just not that magical. Yeah, I guess. almost. I went to one of those like yes, things but I can't for, do it. I believe Auntie Anne at the mall. Yeah, Auntie yeah. yeah. Anne. She yeah. just showed me to do it like like a jump rope. Yeah, and I, I've down. watched them do it. They're very fast. Okay, so, so what do I do? You have now? a giant worm. Oh, a right? giant, a giant, a giant worm. Okay. Okay, then you're gonna make a U. I know you don't understand. Make a U. I would never pass culinary school. <laughs> it's so okay. Just give but me you know Play-Doh. You could do Play-Doh. All right. All right play -Doh, so make a U. Make a U. Make a U. Make a U. Crisscross the U. Crisscross the U. Twist the U. Oh, twist, twist the it. U. And then bring it down. And then bring it down. Then you have three o'clock and nine o'clock. Three o'clock, nine o'clock, six o'clock, twelve o'clock, and, and you have a pretzel. <laughs> Gosh. Or you can make a do twist. Do it one more time. Okay. You ready? Cross it. Twist, twist it, it maybe it, smash it a little it, stick bit. The stick the landing, stick the landing. Stick the landing. You stuck the landing, voila, she got John, a pretzel. John, I'm going to need a well close-up of this. We're Wait, so proud. Wait, which camera do you want it? <laughs> there you go. You did. I'm so proud of you, Christy. <laughs> so, Dang. and then what we did was we made yes. all kinds of toppings that you could put on it. So I made some of them sweet, because I'm the pastry instructor, and I put a <laughs> sure. super ground on it, and I put some cinnamon sugar on them. And then I made some, which are just regular savory warm pretzels and they should still be warm because we just baked them before okay. we got here so they're quite lovely. So at a party how should you serve this? So we have you know, you our lovely donut only. wall. Yeah. Thank you. We have a lovely donut wall that we turn yeah. into our pretzel wall. That way people can take their own warm pretzel. You just make the pretzel that. wall? Yeah, just you go can buy take, it somewhere? Pegs. Yes, okay. it's simple to make. Go, right. don't look up look on a craft uh -huh. site or something and you, uh -huh. you know. <laughs> Look it up. That'll tell you. I'm not the I'm not the engineer. I'm just the pastry chef here. <laughs> so okay. we're hanging the pretzels on the wall <laughs> with our lovely toppings that the students made because they know what they're doing now, right? Okay. And 
you can put it and then everybody can have their own. You can also turn it into sandwiches if you want to. You can turn these into pretzel rolls oh, if fine. you would like as well. I like the So, yes. Yeah, so Excuse can have, me, I'm trying to eat. That's I have right. a jar idea for yes. the party. That way you can put your own toppings on it. So yes. you can put sugar on it. Cinnamon sugar, right? The beer cheese. You can Ooh. put mustard or you can have chocolate. Chocolate. I know. I, I remembered. Yum, yum. I remembered that you love it. So, and there's yeah. a sweet, there's a sweet, uh, pretzel right behind there for you if you want to try oh, the sweet one oh and it's my. got sparkles on it for Look you. Look at how pretty that <laughs> because is. Because you love sparkles, I know. Ah, yeah, you I know, know I love sparkles. Maureen, girl. thank you. Thank you for having us. Congratulations on all your success with these students thank because you. it's all about the teachers. Thank and you. And if you, they can't get the concepts, you know? Yeah. You know? Yeah, what do you have to say about your teacher, Maureen? She uh -oh. is the is best. Is she the best or she what? She is the best, absolutely. What's one thing you learned from her? <laughs> um... Patience. Yeah, in the kitchen especially, kitchen. I'm sure. Yes. That's what I don't have. I wanted to cook fast, so I turned it on high. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, it makes sense. You guys are oh, all no. awesome, congratulations. Yeah. Come back whenever you want and yes. cook for us, will yeah, you? Absolutely. Okay. <laughs>